Mm -hmm. So that is a black place. It's a simple idea for dealing with a complex mental health issue. Five years ago, Jocelyn Duncan was diagnosed with bipolar disorder. So she devised a game to explain her illness to family and friends. Every square on the board has a question and every answer is on a card. Players have to match them up and the prize is better understanding. Once they understood the illness, they apologised and they cried and they've now been supportive and I want that for people all over the world who have just been diagnosed. And the system helps the families of those with bipolar disorder as well. When she was first diagnosed and we tried to get help, there isn't any help there. I was completely in the dark, didn't know what to do, didn't know how to help and felt that everything I was doing was wrong. So how have these boards changed things for you? Simply by understanding means I'm no longer in the dark. And here at the University of Glamorgan, experts hope other people across Wales will also be able to benefit. They've been testing the boards here and their initial findings are positive. What can trigger a bipolar mood swing? The team here have found that the system is a unique way to get people talking about bipolar disorder and they believe it could benefit patients and nurses. Somebody who's been newly diagnosed, who's quite frightened of the illness, frightened of the diagnosis, this could be a way of breaking down that barrier and saying, this is what your illness is about, this is how you, to understand your illness. And better understanding will help them to manage their illness better as well, I think. Jocelyn is already doing that. Many people with a bipolar disorder can achieve a full and productive life. But she now hopes that health trusts in Wales will start using her system so there'll be other winners as well. Best place to be. Mary Claire Kerry-Jones, Wales Tonight. Which is the worst one?